Watch Concepcion of Daily Tribune. Maybe you're wondering, what's that? That's a new song by Jay Durias. We're going to talk about it some more, uh, a lot of it, and, and the challenges, as well as the inspiration that he's come across. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the country's best musicians, I'd say he's the best of his generation. What's up with Jay Durias? Hey, hello, Poch. <laughs> Good afternoon, guys. Good, good afternoon to all the listeners Hello. and all the viewers. All right. First question, Jay. Has the pandemic been good to you or bad or both? Both. Both, both. <laughs> <laughs> but I would say the pandemic uh, gave me, um, I think, I, I, I became more uh, productive, productive as far as songwriting is concerned. Oh, 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 oh. because you time just uh yeah, wala kang excuse eh. Excuse <laughs> studio mo. Wala kang excuse para di gumawa ng nanda. Oo. Oh, oh, oh. Jay, uh, you've been a musician all your life. Uh, balik yes. Balik natin konti ah, nung pagkabata mo. Kasi ang father mo, musician talaga sa Davao. Yeah, he's, okay. he's my uh, main ano, influence talaga. Oo, oh, oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh, oh. Tapos, anong, ilang taong ka nung talagang alam mo na, na, Ang sabi, three years old ka pa lang, tumutugtog ka na eh. Totoo ba yun? <laughs> ko. But uh, alam ko lang, maaga nagsimula. Pero definitely, siya yung nag, ano sa akin, uh, yung talagang in-expose niya ako sa mga, for example, mga folk houses noon. Kasi nung panahon, nung five years old lang ako, dinadala na niya ako sa mga folk houses. Uh, kasi folk singer siya eh. Folk singer. Folk singer. And then, uh, Doon, siguro after a few years, na-introduce ako sa world ng paggigig. Maaga talaga. And oh. then, um, siya din ang nagmulat sa akin sa jazz, sa iba't ibang genres. Ah, siya okay. yung basically pinaka-mentor ko. Mentor mo? Oo, oh, oo, oh, oo. Oh. Mm. And then, sumali ka na sa banda niya. Ay, yeah, siya yung siya 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 unang oh. bandmate ko, pare. <laughs> Okay. May picture tayo Ayun. yun eh. Ipa na, ipapakita natin. Uh, na, ilang taong ka ba nun? Yung may hawak ang bongos? Ay, oo. Oh, ano yun? I was uh, siguro mga around that age, five. You know, six, six or five. Okay. Meaning? Mm-hmm. Um, ano yun eh? Uh, do you have a picture of that? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I think they have that. Oh, anak- oh, oh. Yung nasa Facebook. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Ano yun eh? Yung nagkataon na nandun lahat. Nandun yung mga uncles ko. Nandun pa yung lolo ko. Uh, ayun, kompleto ka. The boys yun, lahat yun. Except for the uh, eldest brother na nasa state yan ko, Joel. Pero, naalala ko yun kasi talagang pinagbihis pa ako ng checkered na red and white eh. Okay. Ang <laughs> okay. haba pa ng buhok ko nun, pare. Oh, pero kamukha mo si JD eh. Parang, Ay, oh, yung na yun. Oh. Oh. Pwede ka pang sabihin cute. <laughs> <laughs> pero regular gigs yun. Um, no, that was just in the house. Ano ah, lang yan? Like with, with, yeah. with, with, with my family. Oh, that's my father on the guitar. That's yung that's nasa left side. That's Bongo. Yeah. Okay. That's my that's my dad. Okay. Sa piano, yan yung youngest brother niya, si Uncle Boy. Okay. Uncle Pedro. Mm-hmm. And then uh, Uncle Danny, yung nasa gitna. Okay. Then yung grandfather ko, lolo ko, nasa banjo. Ano talaga yan eh? Oh. Portrait ng ano yan? The boys. The boys. The Durias the boys. boys. Oh, no. oh, oh. Durias. Du- yan yung original na band, Durias, pare. Oh, okay. Alright. <laughs> oh. Si JD ata yun eh. <laughs> Oo. Oh. Teka. So, totoo na ang musical genes, talent, nasa dugo. O inak na ako. I would say it's the environment. Environment din. Malaking bagay environment. And uh, yung influence. Tsaka yung, yeah, the upbringing talaga, it's very crucial eh, to one's uh, musicianship. Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. Naginagawa mo rin kay Khalil at kay JD? Oo, oh, wala silang choice kundi mamulat sa ganun dahil yun yung trabaho ng tatay nila. <laughs> okay, okay. At what age, Jay, did you form your own band? <laughs> alin, alin pa. Excuse ilan, me, come again? Ilan taong ka nung nagbuo ka ng sarili mong banda? Sa so, oh. Yeah, um, actually, hinaya ako ng tatay ko nung 8 ako. Magka, magka-banda na kami. Nung nalaman niya na marunong ako mag-keyboard, marunong nga mag-sumipra, mag, uh, pare. Sumipra? Nung nakita niya, mabilis ako sumipra, yun na. 
Avail the promo na. <laughs> okay. 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 You know, okay. Yeah. Sinali, okay. Sinali niya ako sa aking first band na pang, ang pangalan is uh, Traffic Jam. Okay. That was the first band. And then, um, I started to, uh, ano then do gigs like, I was really young, pero with this supervision naman, mm-hmm. I was doing gigs sa uh, Insular Hotel, sa Apovie Hotel. Mm-hmm. Uh, kandalasan yan, happy hour. Uh, nag, nag-front ako sa isang, I used to front for this uh, amazing jazz band na si uh, Charlie Bird Trio. Charlie Bird, Charlie Bird Jazz Trio. Ano import yan? Okay. Inimport ng Insular Hotel naman. So, okay. marami din akong napulot doon sa mga yan. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Ayan, mga ganun lang. Tapos uh, later on, naging kabanda ko na sila Michael Alba. You know, doon doon na nagsimula. Okay. Mm-hmm. Nagustuhan mo? Ang ginagawa mo? Ah, uh, yeah, apparently. Hanggang ngayon, yun pa rin ginagawa ko. Yung ginagawa mo at naging buhay mo <laughs> And, uh, na. Oh. Yeah. Oo. Oh, oh. So, And parang you... ano na siya, parang naging uh, routine na siya sa akin. And na- nakita ko na very comfortable naman ako doing uh, music. So, oh, oh, oh. Oh. Nag-decide na ako doon pa lang. Musikero na, musikero na ako hanggat ano hanggat sa dulo, hanggang sa dulo. Pa- paano na buo ang, ang ang South Border? South Border, ang kwento naman noon, uh, si Paul Benitez, yung first drummer namin. Yes. Uh, pumunta ng Davao kasi may may banda ako dati, Hemisphere ang pangalan. Sa ano kami sa Apogee Hotel, mututog Penek Bar. Okay. Ngayon, yung drummer namin ang pangalan Cesar, Cesar Abeliana. Siya yung, um, ba- nung time na yun, ano siya, nagpapaalam kasi babiyahe. Iba uso yun eh. Babiyahe ka, si Kero. Yes. Uh. So we need a replacement. Uh, before nung Hemisphere, okay, let me, you know, elaborate na. In, okay. in Hemisphere, si Bulici Suzara, yan, hmm. si Tat Suzara, okay. yung Suzara Brothers, sila yung kabanda ko before mag-Hemisphere. We were called Wakadus. Okay. Pero nung yung dinala na ako, pumunta ako Manila for a short vacation kasi nag-aaral pa ako. Third year high school ako. Magta-third year high school ako nun. Okay. Um, pagbalik ko ng Davao from Manila, mm-hmm. wala nang Wakadus kasi aaral na, mag-aaral na. <laughs> Babalik na sa pag-aaral eh. Okay. Um, after a while, kinuha ako ng isang banda na called Major Seven. Eventually, naging Hemisphere. Yung banda na yun, uh, yung drummer nga, nagpaalam. So, we had to uh, Find get it. another rep. Ano, yun na nga. Si Bulici nag-suggest na i- why, why don't you try yung friend, friend ko nasa Manila, si Paul Benitez. Mm-hmm. Yun yun, si Paul pumunta ng Davao. Tapos ah. doon kami. Hemisphere kami. Hemisphere. Kasama ko si Tata, si Paul, si Rick. Uh, yun, basically kami lang. Kaming apat lang yung ano... Uh, may iba may ibang kasama si Josel Jimenez sa guitar okay uh, yung dating Neo Colors yun eh si Josel ah, okay Lord, yun tapos um, Kathleen Maglana and Eric Canyones yun kasama ko sa Davao and then eventually si Paul ang nag in fact si Paul talaga ang nag ano eh nag uh, parang nag ujok sa amin na pare parang why don't we try Manila kasi parang may naririnig ako dito sa may energy daw sa Pilipino iba sa ah. tugtog sa so, nagano nag nag persuade na mag Manila kayo yeah parang uh, yung attraction ba kasi syempre pag graduate pa lang ako high school noon pare <laughs> okay so no time na yon um naisip ko ba interested ako mm-hmm. oh yan ang paalam ko mag-aaral ako sa UP <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Pero totoo naman. Oh, nag, 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 <laughs> saglit lang, saglit oh, lang. Saglit na saglit lang. Okay. Ilang years after, nagkaroon na kami ng first ano namin, uh, record deal. At sinuwerte na kami. Ah, okay. So, it didn't take long, ha? Pagpunta na yeah, uh, well, dumating kami dito 1993 sa Manila. Mm-hmm. You correct me, pare, if I'm uh, nag-skip pa ba? Alam mo naman tayo. Uh, basta, <laughs> 1993 and then uh, for a while, uh, we were under the management of uh, June Sanchez. And uh, pumunta kami ng Malaysia for one, two months. Biyahe muna. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Pero before nangyari yan, syempre, pumunta kami dito sa Manila as uh, a rhythm section lang. Wala pa kaming banda. Wala pa kaming guitarist din. Ah, okay. Uh, rhythm section lang kami dumating and 
na meet namin dito yung aming guitarist, si Jack Rufo. Who, oh, si Jack! Mm. Coincidentally, came from New Colors din. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Siya yung unang guitarist. And then, um, tumugtog kami for a while. And then, si Butch ang naging guitarist na namin permanently. Okay. Butch Victoriano. Jay, papa- And then, doon, na-meet na namin si Bricks Ferraris. Yun, nagpuna ah, kami. Ah, okay, okay. Dito muna na-meet sa Manila. Oo. Oh, oh. Manila na, Manila. Okay. Si Paul ang naka-discover nun sa, na sa, ano din, sa Tahanan Village, sa, sa may, ano, sa may uh, Paranaque. Yes. Oh. Jay, itong yeah. first lineup ng South Border, na nagka-album deal, no? Hmm. Uh, pa, paano nabuo yung mga kanta? Ano yan? Uh, may mga songs na akong nabuo sa Davao pa lang, sinusulat ko. Hindi, hindi, hindi siya buong buo, okay. pero dito na sa Manila, na nagmaterialize yung lahat pati areglo ganun habang habang syempre inspired ka dahil na sign up ka eh Tapos first feeling mong ano di ba oh, oh. malaking bagay rin yung mga tulong ng mga musicians na friends oh, yeah. natin uh, like si Marvin Crido siya yung isa sa mga maaga kong nakilala maagang tao <laughs> dito okay. sa Manila nakilala ko na tinulungan niya ako tas dun sa sa recording aspect ng kanta paano i-record, paano i- you know, i-arrange, materialize yung buong thought. Uh, okay. And, uh, yun na nga, uh, yung first uh, demo namin, which pinatugtog namin sa 99.5 RT, okay. ayun, doon namin ginawa sa home studio ni Mark Marvin. Anong Kaya, mar- marami, marami, ah, ano, marami okay. pa akong hindi na kwento, pare, buti na lang tanong mo yun. Okay. <laughs> so, kahit kailan, Nabuo yan. Kahit kailan, later pa yun. This, ah, okay. uh, before that, Losing My Mind pa. That was the first sin- single. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, R&B. Kaya R&B mm-hmm. ang, ano, ano, ang image ng, ano, ng South Border. Mm-hmm. Pero ang balance ang napakalaking hits. Okay. And then, along the way, nawala si Bricks pero tinuloy mo pa rin, di ba? E second lineup, di ba? Yeah. Okay. Nag-follow si Luke Mayares Luke after Mayares. that. And then, uh, ayun, tuloy-tuloy pa rin. Oh, uh, si, oh, oh. Naalala ko yung sinabihan niya ko ni um, Ninong Ryan, Ryan Kebiab, si Maestro. Hi, Ryan. Na, yeah. Kasi since bata lang kami nun, oh. ano yun, eh, nakaka-hurt din yung fact na yung parang kapatid mo nawala di ba, sa, sa banda. Okay. Parang nag ano ako nun kung tutuloy ko pa o hindi. Or, talagang sinabihan ako na may music ka pa rin na may offer but katitigil. Ayun. Tinuloy ah, ko pa rin. Okay. As early as those years, magkakilala na kayo ni Ryan. Yes, through ano yun, pare, um, marami na akong na-meet. Gaya nga na sinabi ko, hmm. if uh, hindi ko lang, lang alam kung nakuwento ko to sa'yo, si Bert De Leon, siya yung una, isa sa mga una pong direct Bert De Leon. Yes. Na pumano na, rest in peace direct. Hmm. Uh, Tito Bert De Leon, he um, gave me one of my first gigs sa arrangement, pag-a-arrange. Oh. Doon ko na-meet si Ryan Kebya kasi yun, kinuha niya rin ako ng time uh, y- noon uh, pag, para mag-arrange. Uh, may inareglo ako sa uh, ilang songs yun eh. Sa, sa album ni uh, Kokoy, Kokoy, ano yun? Laurel. Kokoy Laurel, yes. Okay. Kokoy Laurel. Okay. Oo, oh, oo, oh, oh. Okay. Ayan. Maraming, maraming beses din kami nag-meet sa mga... Hindi ko na rin maalala eh. Naging nino siya sa kasal. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, okay. Mm. All right. What's up? We'll be back with Jay Durias after a short break. Botomoto Halalan 2022, the Daily Tribune special coverage. Christmas masaya pagsama-sama Bong, yung naumpisahan ko, tapusin mo Mga bagong highway, tulay, tren Dapat ma-enjoy na kaagad ng mga tao yan Kailangan lahat bakunado at laging may ayuda pagkailangan 
Huwag dapat makabalik ang mga drug lords para ligtas ang pamilya. Yung ginawa mo mga sakit centers, maganda yan. Padamihin mo pa. Magkasama tayo. Tayo ang nagsimula. Tuloy-tuloy lang. Go. Alright, welcome back to What's Up. Jay Durias in the house. Jay, uh, pinag-usapan natin kanina yung, yung uh, first album ng uh, South Border, uh, tapos nagpalit ng members. Uh, what kept you going all these years? Uh, ilang, ilang palit na yung, ano, yung, yung mga vocalist mo? Tuloy-tuloy ka pa rin. I think it's the necessity eh, to keep moving because it's the only thing that I do. Music, music what keeps me moving actually. Okay. Um, tsaka of course my family uh, tuwing nakikita ko yung mga anak ko mm -hmm. nandun na yung sense of responsibility eh. Nung, kahit nung umpisa pa lang na uh, kailan mong galingan yung you know yung craft mo kasi yun yung uh, livelihood mo and uh, ganun din siguro yun din ang doon ako nag lean eh. so much eh, sa music. Oo. Oh, okay. uh, I would say music talaga is what kept me going. Okay. In other words, you're a working musician. Yes. Come hell or high water. Hindi lang, hindi lang sa work, but pati yung sanity, you know, itong pandemic natin, ang tindi, okay. di ba? Yes, yes. Oh, so, oh, oh. Uh, punta na tayo dun sa question mo kung bakit, <laughs> <laughs> bakit ako nakagawa ng kanta. Sige. Oo. Oh, oh, oh. Kasi napakatagal. May kwenta yes. na ako ah. Dito sa office kasi, sa baba, Uh, on a given day, every day, mm -hmm. yung ano namin dyan, isang editor, lagi nagpapatugtog ng South Border. Ah, okay. Lagi ko naririnig. Hindi naman ako kumikibo. Pinapakinggan mm -hmm. ko lang yung mga comments nila. At <laughs> <laughs> tatalun nila, si Bricks ba yan? O si ganon, ganon. Okay. Anyway, all these years, alam ng mga tao yung kanta mo. What took you so long to write a new song? <laughs> um... Siguro mga ano pare, siguro mga 10 years siguro or, or, or less. Mga 8 years siguro. Kasi the last time I wrote a song na na-release na siya, yung yeah. Langit sa yung tabi, yun yung pinaka-official na nagawa ko. Pero after that, meron pa rin naman for movies. Nakagawa ah, ko yes, for, yes. Uh, oh, oh, oh. you know, remember, uh, Pintakasi, the, the, that project with Amy Marcos. And uh, the, the one with Treb, Monteras, director of Monteras, yung Respeto. Oh yes, uh, of course. Oh. May mga songs naman na offline mm -hmm. din na akong nagawa. But, but I think this is the most, I would say, uh, promoted as of now. Okay. <laughs> uh, better. Kasi oh. feeling ko kasi, you know, we have, we have, we all have something to, ano, to uh, lean on. Like, mm -hmm. uh, kung ano man yung family, uh, whatever. Diba? Love life o mm. siguro trabaho. Kahit na nung ano, uh, God, you know. Sa akin, ang, ang, gumawa lang ng example na ng isang inspiration lang na nag, ano sa akin, nag-help sa akin towards uh, ma yung maka, maka ano ka lang, maka-cross ka lang. Mm -hmm. uh, during the pandemic, siyempre pare, parang ikaw, alam mo yun, you will think about your family yeah. or you'll think about something na parang pwedeng mag uh, motivate sa'yo na mag uh, you know, to keep moving forward. Yeah. I, I, I just thought na grabe ang music ko, oh, parang sobrang tinulungan ako maka-get by mm -hmm. through these hard times. Kaya gumawa ko ng better uh, dahil din dun eh, sa thought na yun parang Diba, as long as I got you, I'll be fine. Yes. So, oh, oh, oh. kaya siya nabuhay. Yung kantang yan. Bago natin iparinig sa viewers, listeners, and followers mo, ang napansin ko lang sa pagkasulat mo dito, ano, hindi siya, wala siyang direct references to anyone. It's general. Pero, yeah, in general. Yes, yeah. yes. Pero yung mga images, eh. Kasi ang, ang pagsusulat ng kanta, may mga lyrics na, mm. ano eh, ang, ang pagkagawa mo kasi, it adheres to the rules of uh, poetry. Mga images. Yeah. Conscious ba yun pag, pagsulat mo? 
inisip mo yung mga bagay na what makes you feel better? That's very honest ano lang uh, opinion ng aking uh, thoughts. Kung ano yung kung, kung ano yung na ano ko lang nung time na sinulat ko siya, gusto kong magsulat ng isang simple lang naman mm. na madali lang ano yun, i-digest. Digest. Okay. Uh, tapos um yun na nga, feel good song, pare. Uh, yes. You know, mahirap mag, magbigay ng parang masyadong komplikado na <laughs> na kwento. Pero that's ano talaga, that's very honest uh, na ano, na kwento ng panahon ng ginawa, ginagawa ko yung katingan. Paano mo ito ginawa? Sa home studio mo? Doon, sa taas lang. Parang one of the ano, fastest ano, made songs in my life. Okay. Talagang ano, sobrang ano lang siya simple. Pero nung narinig ko siya the next day, sabi ko, uy, parang good pa rin, good pa rin sa feeling. Uh-huh. Sabi ko, gusto kong ilabas to. <laughs> Game na to. Uh, Game na ba tayo? Pwede ba natin marinig ngayon? Yung kanta? Man, it's my honor, pare. Okay. Let's go ahead. Hold on. Yeah, we'll play it now. All right. You are my to app. Whenever it feels so bad Clearing my mind from a blur Simply your mind, breath of fresh air Taking away my pain Pushing me back to my game And now I am back to my flow Cause you really are my miracle I feel so much better Very nice song. Para Thank you, man. Thank imagine you. Imagine ko, uh, bumabiyahe. Takas ng hangin. Open yung... Yun na mismo. <laughs> fishing, ba? para fishing. Fishing. Sarap oh, ko fishing. The outdoors. Okay. Outdoors. We'll, we'll pause for one more break and we'll talk about better some more. Botomoto Halalan 2022 The Daily Tribune Special Coverage. Masaya, pagsama-sama. Be updated sa news and happenings katribu. Hatid ng Daily Tribune sa inyo ang mga balitang napapanahon sa loob at labas ng bansa. Kami na ang bahala sa paghahatid sa inyo ng mga latest and reliable news. We got you covered sa programang Tribune News on Q. Mapapanood mula umaga hanggang gabi, lunes hanggang biyernes sa Daily Tribune Facebook page at Tribune Now on YouTube. Our steps can lead us 
to millions of doors opening, millions of paths unfolding, and millions of reasons to keep going. Now's the time to be with the network that gets better every day for you. This public service advisory is brought to you by Daily Tribune and 100.3 RJFM. Vaccination, isolation, gotta keep up with my nutrition, gotta maintain my body condition, then I can take my vaccination. What do I choose? What do I take? As long as it is not a fake. AstraZeneca, Moderna, BioNTech, even Sinovac, okay now. Vaccination for the nation, no more isolation. With vaccination. This public service advisory is brought to you by Daily Tribune and 100.3 RJFM. Botomoto Halalan 2022, the Daily Tribune special coverage. Christmas ayah, pagsama-sama. Alright, welcome back. Thank you for the song. We're talking to Jay, the one and only Jay Durias, and he has a new song. We just played it a while ago. Better. Thank you. Good mood. Jay, paano maririnig ng mga followers mo at ng buong Pilipinas itong Better? Ah, coming out soon sa Spotify. Marami lang tayo ng inaayos na you know Spotify kasi maghintay ka talaga. Okay. But yeah, it's coming out soon, and I'll be uploading it. Soon sa aking mga pages, oh. sa Facebook, sa Instagram, uh, sa uh, soon very soon din sa iTunes. Um, uh-huh. Ayon, uh, na isip ko rin pare no, kasi nung sa kakapanood ng mga you know balita tungkol sa COVID, yes. yung mga victims na nakita mo, yung mga nababalitaan mong malungkot. Mm. You can only wish for them, eh, na you can only pray for them. Para sa akin parang gusto mong tumulong as much as possible, you know, sa sobrang dami, million-million, parang ma- makakaano ka talaga eh, kahit na naka, nakahilata ka lang sa kama, parang may, mapapaisip ka talaga eh, kung anong gusto mong i-contribute. Uh-huh. So parang feeling ko, since meron akong ability to, to you know, to do music, write songs, um, siguro yung pinaka-contribution ko itong, itong pandemic. Uh, hoping na yung song will make them feel feel better. Kaya y- yun yun ang pinaka ano ko yung parang abuloy uh, hindi abuloy at <laughs> abdo. Um, alay 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 sorry. alay. Oh, oh handog. <laughs> Ayun, yun yung parang um, nag-wish na lang ako for everybody to be better. For yes. everything to be better. It's a perfect title. Masarap pakinggan sa umaga. <laughs> tanghali sa gabi. Ako, na good mood ako ngayon kasi may, medyo may problema eh. Sa office. Uy. <laughs> yun ba, reverse, yun, yun, isa rin yun eh. Parang, you know, yung ano natin na uh, fight or flight, di ba parang ganun? Parang, i-reverse ko lang yung effect ng depression ng pandemic. Parang ng time yun, sabi ko, sh- sh- reverse natin, i- just feel positive or make something that's, ano, parang that will, will affect the people na you know, to be inspired. Uh, and of course, hindi ko rin naman magagawa ito kung wala din mga tao na ikinig like the message borders, 
Mm-hmm. So yan, pare magbisa shoutout na ako. Ah. Sige, go go go. <laughs> Ayun, um of course uh yung mga message borders and, and fans na nandiyan pa rin hanggang ngayon from day one. Sila Tita Julie and Aiza Mutya, uh, Joyce, Krisa and Daphne. Ma- I'm sure marami pa akong nakalimutan i- i-mention. Pero kung hindi dahil sa kanila, ito yung mga naging close ko sa sa ano namin sa site namin noon, may merong message borders eh, followers na. Ah, okay. Sila yung mga naging close ko oh, oh, oh. na they kept believing in my music, in our music. Uh-huh. Uh, para sa kanila to, yung mga sinulat ko, yung itong sinulat ko na to. And uh, uh, na rin, hello na rin kay Mimi na nasa <laughs> sa States, eh, kung nasa family. Oh yes, para, hello Mimi! Uh, Si Rick, si yung kabanda ko dati, si Rick, uh, mga anak. So, kasi, basta lahat ng mga kamag-anak natin sa States, kay Uncle Boy, uh, Pedro Durias, and uh, Josephine Durias, and Pia, and Gab. Ayan. Um, Your mother. Yun na, yun na, oo, oh, si Mama, mag-isa lang sa Davao. Oo. I hope, picture, maka, ano ako, makapalik na ako. May picture mo eh. Hindi yata napakita. Mm-hmm. Oo, oh, oo. Oh. Hello po. Yeah. Um, hello sa lahat ng mga kaibigan at kamag-anak. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yun pare, yun lang. Yun ang ano ko eh. It's, it's a parang a, a reset na ma, ano, maisip mo yung buhay. Maisip mo kung ano yung meron ka. You know. Uh, appreci- appreciating what you have. Yes. And, uh, uy, wow. Yeah, sexy ah. <laughs> <laughs> Batang bata. Nanay ko yan. Nanay ko yan. Oh, 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 oh. Mm. Hello. Mrs. Mama Consulta. Napaka palad. Mo. Pare, thank you. Thank you for having me. Ha? Masyadong honor for me to be with Pocholo Concepcion. Nak naman ha. Yung mga hmm. nakapaligid sa'yo dyan, baka gusto mong bata- batiin. Ano sila? Busy sila eh. <laughs> siya <laughs> tuwing right. at si Kalil. Okay. Hello to Kalil and JD ha. JD. And also din to Kalil. Ate Kel. Yan, si Daddy. Hello. Ano ba? Mami. Uh-oh. Ayun. Okay. My wife, Helene. Yes. Helene, nasaan ka? Wala, tulog. Malis. <laughs> Jay, uh, we'll have a little fun. Uh, we'll show okay. you pictures. And then, right. ang, ang gagawin mo, eh, a little backstory about it. Nako, dapat maalala ko yan kung saan. <laughs> okay, sige. Go. Sige. Uy, si Aiza. Uh, ito yung shoot namin nung ano, uh, unang playlist sa Araneta. Okay, before it's, a, it's an event playlist. Oh. Yes, okay. yes. That's a parang campaign. Yung pro- promotion. Yes. Shoot. Oh. Promoting Filipino music. Yes. Next. Ano ba to? Oy, with AGs. Uh, ito yung nag-musical director ako sa show nila. Ah, okay. Mm. That's Gino oh. Cruz, no? Ano ba to? Oy, ah, oy, no, during... Yeah, that's right. SB19. Yeah, when okay. I was... Um, oh. Yes, we're producing their single... What? The, the two singles, yes. Jay, you say mo na anong role mo sa SB19? You produce. I, I was their co-producer and arranger. Okay. The first two songs, no? Yep. Okay. What? What and Mapa. Mapa. Great, great, great. Next one. Hmm. Yan yung ano kasagsagan ng pandemic pare. Mm-hmm. Sa studio pa yan. Uh, wala lang. Na, na napanood ko lang yung ano yung isang Naka-intubate. So, parang shots. <laughs> Laban lang. Ah, okay. Hmm. Uy. Oo. Oh, para hindi na, hindi na baby ngayon yan. Hindi na ginagawa sa akin yan. <laughs> okay. Oh. Ayaw. Ayaw niya nang gawin sa akin yan. Oo. Oh. <laughs> Ang laki niya na. Binata. Oo. Oh, JD. Durias. Before the pandemic yun, si- siguro months lang before the pandemic. Two months before the pandemic. Mm-hmm. Napakagaling ni gitarista. As young as he is. Mm-mm. Yes, next one. Mm, thank you. That, this is a picture uh, with uh, my uh, co-judges sa, ano, sa Taiwan Excellence. Mm-hmm. Yung, ano, namin, yung uh, Song for Excellence. Okay. That's uh, Fitzgerald. Uh, si, ano, si, um, Frenchy. Frenchy D. Si, uh, That's between. Between. Huh? Si Paolo. Si, my God, si Pare. Nakalimutan ko tuloy pa. Uh, ten... La, na, na mental black ako. 
<laughs> pare tawag ko dun eh. I love you, pare. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, next one. Yeah, so, yun yung uh, pag-uwi ni mama dito sa anak sa da- from from the states. Aha, uh-huh, aha. Uh-huh. Pre-pandemic. Right. Okay. Yun na. Ito na, ito na yung ano, yung, so, sa studio lang yan sa taas. Mm. Nag-ano kami, uh, music, workout. Oo. Mga anak ko, si Khalil, si JD. Yun yata yung ano eh. <laughs> with cheat alignment. With cheat, no? with cheat alignment. Yeah, right. in oh, the oh. making. Okay, alright. Alright. Do we have more? Oh, we have more. Oh, eh, bulichi. Yung, ano, <laughs> photoshoot namin. Okay. Hmm. Bolichi Suzar. Yes. Ito sa uh, LA Guitar Center. Ah, sa LA. Yan. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, si oh, Kalil, oh. Uh, and mm-hmm. South Border. Oh, oh, oh. Ayun. Okay. We have three more. <laughs> Oy. Ayun, ito si ano si pre-pandemic with JR sa probinsya. Mm, huh? kalimutan ko na 'yung pangalan ng probinsya, pero malapit sa Siargao. Ah, okay. Sa Mindanao. Oo. Mhm. Ito sa ano to sa New York. Mhm. Uh, kasi saan kami nakatira uh, yung 2019 tour namin US tour mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. last one mm-hmm. yung music mu- ano muchikahan mu- with the ano maestro Ryan Kevin uh, host kami ng show uh, si Nyo yung guest namin Nyo Volante okay Jay uh, what else are you doing aside from having um, least uh, better well it's uh Christmas season. I'm 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 currently recording a Christmas album mm. right now. Okay. Lalabas siya. Um, oh. Trying to be inspired again and some do something na original Christmas original. Pero yun nga. Hinihintay ko pa. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Ikaw yung artist na ano ano? Kailangan maramdaman. Kailangan maramdaman. Kailangan mangyari bago ko masulat. Oh, oh, okay. Pero uh, hindi ako nakasulat out of ano lang parang so, blank sulat. moment. Ah, Pwede music sige, pero dapat talagang may spark para totoo, genuine. <laughs> At saka pag malapit ng deadline. <laughs> Yun, cramming artist. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Jay, my last question. Man. Marami ka nang nakatrabaho. Mga legends, mga bata, lahat. Mm-hmm. Marami ka nagawang kanta. What have you learned so far as a musician, uh, as a person? Marami pare, pero to sum it all up, ano eh, um, kailangan talaga maging, ano ka, uh, i-cherish mo lahat ng moments na kasama mo sila. Kasi you'll never know what will happen. Mm-hmm. Um, gaya niyan, ah, uh, I lost, you know, members of my family. Not not to COVID, but na-realize ko lang na napaka-temporary lang sa glit lang tayo. Mm-hmm. And uh, I, I really try my best to, you know, to um, make that thought sink. Mm-hmm. Uh, kasi ang, ang tendency ko kasi, ano eh, mag, mag-detach eh. Pag ganun. Pero I'll, siguro I will try to learn how to... Uh, make them feel that I am really feeling them, you know? Mm-hmm. Things like that. Sometimes, because most of the time I'm passive, especially if, I, if I'm uh, into songwriting mode or music, music you know, composition na nandun ako dun sa, sa zone na yun. But, um, you know, um, mas gusto ko lang, siguro, learning pa ako pare. Mm-hmm. Wala pa ako dun sa, sa talagang, ano, uh, alam ko na yung meaning ng, ng buhay. Pero kumbaga, kung may masasabi man ako, uh, cherish your family, cherish your friends habang nandyan pa. Tsaka mabait ka. Yung masasabi ko sa Mabait ka, kaya ka sinuswerte. <laughs> okay. Uh, ano lang, basta tuloy mo lang kung, kung saan ka, saan yung strengths mo doon ka lang. Huwag ka nang... Okay, <laughs> okay. Siguro itong better, parang, in a way, it's your, it's your ano eh, sa mga taong nawala sa'yo, no? Parang, 
Yung din siguro part right? subconsciously, think, you know. Yeah, yeah. Malamang kaya lumabas din 'yan kasi you know, 'yun naman 'yun eh mga frustrations mo sa gusto mong mangyari. Mm. Talaga. Na, na ano lang na highlight lang natin, na enhance lang nung pandemic din lalo. Okay, Jay. Na in a reverse reverse way. Ni reverse na, reverse psychology ba? Ah, <laughs> uh, what do you mean? Para kung ni-reverse yung feeling na imbis na maging depressed ka, mm-hmm. imbis na makastabi, gawa ka na lang something na mag happy, Tama. para na rin ma-affect mo yung mga tao na sa paligid mo. Alright. Jay, message to your fans, followers, parting words. A big thank you. Sobrang, I really appreciate the love all these years. Uh, of course, what is music kung wala namang tenga ma- makikinig kaya maraming maraming salamat all right jay durias new song better thank you poch watch out for it thank you very much jay durias walang kupas this has been poch conception on of what's up catch us every tuesday on our facebook page and youtube facebook yeah. tribune now and it's 32 days Before Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thank you.